Okay, so this next effect is called Drift, and it uses a deck of cards, and in a time-honoured manner, you offer a card to be selected. But before the spectator selects it, so it's not really fair, all the cards are face down, so we make it a lot fairer, we'll turn all the cards face up. But then again, you say, I might be spreading more on one card than another, so again, it might be uh, too contrived. So the, the fairest way is if you just name a card, just name any card you can see there. Two of clubs. Two of clubs. Happy with that card? Yep. You can change your mind if you wish. That's fine. Okay, so your card is a two of clubs. Remember your card, and we just bury your card deep down into the deck. So it's lost somewhere in the deck. Now, the strange thing is, I'm not going to find your card. I'm going to lose the rest. And what I mean by that, is if you give a card a little shape like so, the seven of diamonds disappears. The nine of hearts, the two of spades. In fact, if you look all the way through these cards now, all these cards have disappeared completely, being just blank face cards. What was your card? Two of clubs. The two of, ah, two of clubs, still there. And you place the two of clubs onto the spectator's hand, and remain, show all the other cards, these are blank, completely, which has a strange effect on the spectator's selected card. You give a little snap, that one goes as well, and it with 52 blank pieces of card, and that's drift.